Jalen, talk about the challenges from the safety position of going against a quarterback like Kenny Pickett, who is very mobile, and a quarterback like Keaton Slovich is more likely to stay in the pocket. Right. Uh, those guys, uh, you listed Pickett and uh, Slovich, those guys are great pocket passers. They like to put the ball on, on their receivers and let the receivers run. Um, as far as the safety position, we're going to have to have great eye discipline, um, looking at our keys uh, and trusting what we see, just playing fast, playing football. So I say our eye discipline has to be on point. Jalen, give us a little veteran leader analysis of what you saw from some of the young guys there in the secondary that got a chance to play on Thursday. Oh, yeah, uh, they were ready to play. Um, Wide-eyed, you know, ready to just get in kneeling and play. Um, they play fast. They play physical. You know, we have some uh, technical stuff to clean up as far as, you know, just step a place here or backpedal here. But as far as um, effort and, and attitude, those guys are there. So. Jalen, it's, it's a new season, new team on, on both sides. Do you take anything from, from the pit game last year into this one? Um, we know that they'll try to attack us in, in some ways uh, that they were successful in last year. Um, but, you know, we come to work every day. Uh, you know, just trust, trust, trust our preparation, trust what the coaches are telling us, and, you know, just go in ready to play. Um, they'll have some wrinkles. We'll have some wrinkles, but, you know, we'll be ready to play. Jalen, how important is it for you guys in the back end to help with the with the run support because you know Pitt's a team that's going to try to run the football. Oh yeah, like you said, uh, they're going to try to come in and, and run the ball and and take shots off of off of play action. Um, you know they bring an extra lineman here and there to balance out their formation so they can run the ball. Um, so uh, fitting from the back end as far as our safeties and our and our star, uh, we're going to have to have a big impact in in our run fits this week. What was it like seeing Kamal and, and Tamara get those interceptions? I know Tamara is his first start. Kamal played some last year, but got in the game early and, and made that play. Yeah, man, those two guys, though, they work hard. Uh, you know, they're always in practice making those plays. So when it when it came in the game, you know, it wasn't a surprise. Uh, proud of those guys. Proud of those. Proud of the way they uh, they executed and and took advantage of the opportunity when it came. Jalen, some teams rely on the RPO for that run pass option. Others do the more traditional, like Pitt, play action. Can you talk about the differences in the recognition for you guys and maybe what might present the most issues? Uh, like I said, it just, that comes to our preparation, you know, just trying to read their keys and read their tendencies uh, and, and trying to be a step ahead and knowing when those players are going to come, when the play action is going to come and when they want to, you know, run past option and get their guys the ball in space. So just just reading our keys and knowing who aligns where, um, I feel like that's going to be big for us. General Jabari Small said that he felt like the pit game last year was one that, that Tennessee let get away. Does that bring extra motivation for Pitt this time around? Um, I don't think it brings any extra motivation. Uh, it's another Saturday. Another Saturday we have to strap it on. Another Saturday we have to – play as a team and um, this one's on the road so we're going to have to go up there and, uh, with, a, with an attitude that you know it's going to be a four quarter dog fight and we're going to have to go up, uh, to Pittsburgh and, and take it out um, take come out with a win so thank you all